very much of like the juicy couture look and it has the same branding with the rhinestones in the back that says pretty little things it is an olive mesh halter neck open back body con dress It's your girl Jonique, making it look unique, and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, definitely subscribe. I create fashion-related content from fashion styling advice, lookbooks, even hauls, so you guys can see what I purchased. And today, we are going to be doing a Pretty Little Things haul. So this is my first time ever shopping from Pretty Little Things. I didn't want to spend too much. That is a tip, like if you want to try out a different brand or try out their sizing, definitely create like a budget of how much you want to spend. So my budget was like $100. I didn't want to spend more than that just because I didn't know what was going to fit me. So I only got a few minor things. So this is going to be more like a mini haul so stay tuned as you can see I wanted to do something different we brought out the neon lights today so we're gonna set the vibe set the mood and I hope you guys enjoy this video okay so we all know fall is approaching so I wanted to get some staple fall pieces so the first outfit I decided to go with is this tracksuit so you know like the juicy couture um velvety two-piece set that's what this was going for but i love the pretty little thing detail that they have with the rhinestones in the back and the quality is amazing i did get this in a size eight i believe because i was kind of confused on how their sizing run they have like six for medium eight for medium a lot of their pieces run small so i wanted to keep in mind to upsize However, with this piece, I wouldn't. So I might have to wear it as like an oversized sweatpants look. It is very long. These are the cuffs. And the thing with Pretty Little Thing, they do sell these sets separately. So just keep that in mind when you want to purchase these items. Next up, I got the top for it. Um, this is called the Shape Dusty Pink Belvoir Extreme Crop Sweater. I did get this in a UK 12, which is a US 8. So as you can see, I did size up on this too, just because I saw that it runs tight or it's small on the model and I didn't want it to run small. I want it to fit a little snug and a little cozy. I don't want to feel tied up in my clothes. So I like that it comes with a hoodie. It has the same branding with the rhinestones in the back that says pretty little things. It's not too heavy. It is very lightweight as well. It does fit me fairly nicely and I'm kind of upset that the bottoms didn't fit me. Probably definitely get the bottoms in a smaller size so I can get that cute tight fitted juicy couture look. Okay so next up I did get this wide leg jogger in the size US 8. So this is a UK 12. I love these joggers however i did get them too big i think i'm more like a us6 with pretty little things bottoms just because it does have a lot of stretch to it and with these joggers they are wide leg so they're very baggy definitely size down on this if you're around my body type amazing top-notch quality they do come with side pockets which is a must and i fell in love with the branding that they have here i love how they put the stamp right there very cozy very comfortable perfect for the winter time and i love the color that's really what made me get it it's giving me like a pastel green perfect for the fall colors so next up i got the sweater to the bottoms um i really love this sweater i did get this in a us6 so as you can see this one's gonna fit me a lot tighter and true to size so i am a us6 so far and pretty little things i love the quality of the sweater just like the joggers i love the branding that they have here it adds a nice touch to this bland simple sweater i like that it's cozy i like the cuffs everything like that and it is cropped as well so it gives you the option if you want to wear it with jeans or the sweatpants you could do it as a set but as a set it is fire with pretty little thing just keep in mind they don't really have reviews so you just have to do a lot of trial and error with their piece if you didn't know pretty little thing has did a couple collabs with major celebrities like doja cat tiana taylor and one of the items I got is from the Shensia line. So if you don't know Shensia, she's a popular Caribbean artist. You should definitely go check out her music. But this was one of the pieces I got from her line. It's an olive mesh halter neck 
open back bodycon dress. So I did get this in a, a US 6. So I would say first trying it on, it fits like a glove. It is super sexy as you can see. It is amazing quality. It is not see-through, which I love because I was kind of like hesitant at first when it said mesh. Usually mesh be see-through, but this is not see-through at all. And it has the cow neck. I've been wanting dresses that have like the cow neck um, detail to it. And I really like this. And the color on my skin is just amazing the only uncomfortable part about this dress is just the halter tying strings kind of irritates your neck if you tie it too tight size up if you have bigger boobs or if you want it to fit tighter that's your preference as well it's a little short a little tight it fit in the curve it's hitting the curves real nice so yeah i really like this piece i think she did a really good job with this collab okay guys so this is the last item i got and this is from the tiana taylor line she did have a lot of like new york inspired looks on her feature on the website so this is the item that i did get it is an oversized t-shirt dress i could definitely see myself wearing this with a nice belt or you can wear it oversized like this with some Probably some cargos look, look nice with this with some combat boots. Definitely streetwear. And I like the detail that she has here. It says New York. And I did get this in a US too because that was the only size that they had. And I thought I was going to be... I was actually kind of hesitant at first just because I'm not a two. I'm not an extra small. But this was very oversized. So you can get away with a US too. I think if I had size up and got this in a medium, it would have been a lot bigger. So I'm super happy that... It came just like this. You can even crop it if you may like and have this type of look. But this is really what made me buy the piece. This little detail definitely will enhance any look. Okay, guys, so that concludes the video. I hope you enjoyed this mini haul. I know this is my first time shopping for Pretty Little Things, so I didn't want to spend a lot of money. However, I did buy some more clothes, so stay tuned for that second haul. Like I mentioned before, if you would like to try out a new brand and don't know si what size you may be, definitely start off with a small budget of like $40, $50 just to see how you fit in the jeans, how you fit in the tops or the dresses so you can have an estimate if you shop with them again. So thank you guys so much. I love all the pieces that I did purchase and I can't wait to add them to my collection this fall, this summer, all year round. We are on the road to a thousand. We're getting up there. My most recent video just hit 10K. So I'm super excited about that and it's climbing. And thank you guys so much for the love and support and have a wonderful rest of your day and stay COVID free. Bye guys. Oh, 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 oh,